All right, everybody, it's Steve, hey. it's Donna, and people are honking. People are crazy this morning. The town is crazy when it wakes up. It's crazy when it goes to bed, and it's crazy when it wakes up. Yeah, we had, a, we had an average average night, average yeah. breakfast, but it's time for the Goodwill bins. It's about quarter till. There's about 30 people here in line. Have not had my coffee yet. So yeah, we're going pre-coffee, so that's dangerous. a little slow. But we ran out of time at the hotel, so here we are. We're going to see what we can find and hopefully do better than yesterday. We got stickers with us today in case anybody, we yep. see anybody. Yep. We brought the stickers. <laughs> yeah. Um, uh, real quick, like last night and this morning I made the video that came out before this. I apologize. It's not very well done but i'm doing with a program i don't usually use and oh, we're on so it road. is it is what it is but i am able to make it and i am able to upload it and get it posted so yeah. we're doing the best we can but here is day two of the goodwill bins in st louis missouri let's go sorry zoom zoom, zoom. How you doing?
kill people here. What an interesting thing. Gold rings. 
Uh -huh. People are crazy. Yeah, that's way more busy. these things up here. I don't think these are worth That's a no. People gear made in USA. Fifteen listed, forty three sold. So I find one kind of like this. Things are expensive. That is a good find right there. Let's see if we can find a model or something. It's called a Terra Terra Humara pack. Hundred and fifty dollars. It's like a good hundred dollars, I think. That's pretty darn close right there. And that's all. It says it's sold for 130. Get this. Oh, that is trashed. That's a no. Little Pikachu Pez. It's good till 2028, I think, like dollar auction. This ain't gonna weigh. This might cost me a dime, literally 20 cents. So, people like Pokemon stuff. Might just put that in dollar auction. Uh, what else we got? We never did find the other one of these boots. Got this 
Spider-Man wall tin. I don't know. Probably cost me a dollar. Might get it for dollar auction. We'll see what Donna says. Here's some Crocs with the fur lining. They're dirty, but they're not hard to clean. What's that? Thirty-four sixty-nine. All right. Have a good day. Thank you very much. Okay. All right, we're back. Donna's getting oh. the hand sanitizer going. <laughs> okay. Oh well. So, what do you think of day two compared to day one, Donna? Oh my goodness, these people are crazy in the mornings. Yeah, they're more crabby in the mornings. I don't think uh, anybody had coffee there. No, everybody. There's pushing and shoving. Yeah, there and was throwing of stuff and people climb over the top of you to get stuff. Yeah, when it opened it was probably 50% more people than yesterday when it when they opened the doors and people were just not <laughs> nearly as friendly in the morning, I guess. So, yesterday we talked to a few, several different people and they were really yeah. friendly. But I will say this, and the smell of of fruitiness is in the air. Fruitiness? <laughs> What does that mean? <laughs> I don't, I don't know. They know. didn't have coffee, but they had something else. Oh, oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's legal here, so it's <sighs> it's it's up in there. Um, we did better, though. I completely think we did better. We found much better stuff. You, you found a bag. I found a bag that's $100 to $150. I found more little toys. I really like finding those little toys. I found a Sesame Street bunch today. She found a little wooden Noah's Ark. Yes. Um, and I found a, a puzzle that is... Sells for about 25 30 bucks. What was the other thing you found? No, before that, I looked it up and there was three Linux, listed, two sold. A Linux little. Was it ornament? Uh huh. A yeah, sleigh. a little, little sleigh ornament. I'll pop it up here. Yeah. Uh, if I can. I, no, I'm make, I don't know if I'm going to be able to. I tried to pop it up there. If it wasn't there, I'm sorry. You want um, me to get it? But I think it sells for like 20 25 bucks. Yeah, we'll okay, get it. Hold on. She's going to get it. Then I don't have to pop up nothing. So when we leave here, uh, we're gonna turn our directions on towards Kentucky, but the first thing we're gonna do is get Donna coffee and get me probably a soda, cause I need some caffeine. I tried Celsius yesterday. Ooh, oh, 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 oh. didn't like that at all. Um, but I did chug it and it helped me get where I was going. But you see her back there working, working, working. Here she comes. Here, since I had the camera on, I showed my stuff. She can show a couple things she got. Okay. Oh, I forgot about the hats. All right. Woo! Uh, okay. Okay. All right. There's the Lennox sleigh ornament and that. Yeah, there's like three listed and two sold. I think it's like 25, 30 bucks. 20 to 30 dollars, yeah. I think, if I and remember And the box correctly. looks in great condition. Yeah, definitely. And then we found this. It says... Vintage puzzle. Tar a tarot puzzle? Tarot, I don't know. And there's only two listed, but they're listed out of the UK for like 35 bucks Here's plus shipping. Here's what they look like. There's none sold, but since there's only two listed in the UK, we thought, and it looks like it's brand new. I doubt it's ever been actually put, put together. Put together, yeah, it's tied and but. stuff still. And the instructions are in there, so. I think definitely worth the pick up. Taking and then a chance on that one. One other thing, fun thing that she found. A hat box, but. No one looked in it. And in this hat box are American Girl doll hats. And they have their little tag on them right here that tells you what they are. American Girl doll. I don't know if you can see it. But, I think that white one needs to go through the wash, right? Yeah. But yeah. And then this furry one. And then look this one yeah that's like a victorian era hat and then the a little straw, straw hat. hat and then this one yeah now i've sold them sold i've, I've sold, sold them i've sold them before I've sold them. i sold american girl doll outfits before and they did really well so i'm just hoping that these hats do pretty fine also yeah but but yeah i didn't pay much for that that can't weigh that much so might be able to sell the little hat box hat too. box with it yeah the hat box might actually be american girl doll hat box we don't know well but. i think it is it's um 
see if there's a tag in it. There is not, but no tag. It's easy to look up American Girl doll stuff, and there's yes. a, there's a skew. Made in China. I don't know. So we'll see. Maybe not. But all right. So day two, I think better than day one. Yeah, and I think so as far as like what we found. Yes, but, what we found. Oh my goodness, people were just hands like yeah it everywhere. was it was way more aggressive <laughs> i would say yeah so all right, speaking of aggressive donna how about we get your coffee yes <laughs> all right we're gonna go to kentucky we are hoping to garage sale there but the weather forecast does not look like it says snow it possible snow showers tomorrow morning that's crazy so we may have to go thrifting instead which man I, i'm really hoping to garage sale but if we got a thrift then we'll hit some goodwills and see what we can find yeah, so maybe we'll see some famous youtubers yeah maybe <laughs> but for now we're going to get coffee get out of st louis and head to kentucky so Yay! thank you all for watching like and subscribe i think that's what you say and share with your friends and all, and all that stuff yeah and, and we, check out the guy we posted yesterday let's help each other grow our channels yeah, I don't remember the name right now. I His name is Ray out. and um, Emily. Okay. Right? Ray and Emily, yes. Uh -huh. So, all right, cool. Thanks for watching, everybody. We'll see you on the next one. Peace. Peace. <laughs> <laughs> Bye.